My goal as your snowboard coach is to get you to be the most awesome snowboarder possible so that you can have way more fun on the slopes, ride till the end of the day effortlessly, and prevent injury. So today's video, I got a 15 minute workout that you can literally do at your hotel room, your house, or even at the gym so that you can ride like this. So in today's workout, we're gonna do five different movements. First, we're gonna start with the air squat all the way down, all the way up for a full one minute. The second movement is going to be a jumping 180 with a squat in between. Yes, our legs are gonna burn and then 180 back. If you are uncomfortable jumping, absolutely no problem. The modification will be pivot over one foot, squat, pivot back, squat and then switch legs so that you're able to balance out both of them and our third movement is going to be a lateral lunge start in a neutral position go all the way out squat come back up go all the way over come back up if you are unable to go all the way to the bottom that's fine squat and go as far as you can totally cool our fourth movement is going to be a russian twist essentially get on the ground hands are going to be up feet and shoulders off of the ground and then touch so we're gonna rotate through our core. And then our fifth movement is going to be a plank. We're gonna be just like this. We're gonna hold that for a minute. Now our goal is to work through the entirety of the minute and then transition from move to move as quick as possible. But our legs core are gonna burn. We're only gonna be working for that designated minute and you can follow it along down here. Let's get right into this. We're first gonna start with air squats in three, two, one, all the way down all the way up. Our big focus is trying to keep our spine upright, our movement controlled, our knees tracking over our toes. I like to stay in my snowboard stance so that it feels very intuitive. You can even put your snowboard out there and figure out exactly what your stance is. But really think about keeping that spine up, chest up. And then you can also, just to break it up, do a couple sets looking in your dominant direction just so you can understand what it feels like to have this strong body position while only rotating our eyes. And then, of course, go in your switch direction so you're feeling pretty good. Now we're gonna do this, this work for a full one minute. And then if you need a rest, the next movement's gonna start regardless. So just take your time, come back to this video and progress as we go through. So we got five seconds left of this movement. Three, two, one next we do jumping 180s now get into a partial squat jump use your spine use your shoulder if you're uncomfortable with this movement you can still do the movement but pivot over a foot and then squat down pivot back and squat down so you have a nice modified 180. pick a point down the line or pick a point so that when you're doing your 180s you're mimicking what it's like to do snowboard maneuvers you can also go in the opposite direction where I'm looking and then I go blind, so I'm mimicking backside rotations. Now our goal is just to keep moving for a full one minute. Yes, your legs are gonna get tired. My legs are already starting to burn. Again, focus on rotating through the spine and feeling good. We're gonna move and groove. Here we go, we got 10 seconds left. Five seconds. Excellent. Our next movement, lateral lunges. What we're gonna do is we're gonna sink all the way down, stand all the way back up, switch legs all the way down, all the way back up. Again, you can do this freaking anywhere. You can do this in the next time you want to get warmed up. You can do this at a hotel room. You can do it at the airport if you want. We're just gonna keep moving for a full one minute. This is our third movement. We got two core exercises next. 
If you're unable to go all the way down, not a problem at all, just go move lateral. Just try to get your body to move. Each time, try to progress a little lower so that you can get your legs to get stronger as well as working on your flexibility. 15 seconds left of this maneuver. We're almost there. 10 seconds. Don't forget to breathe. Excellent. Three, two, one. Next movement, get down on your tailbone. Legs up, shoulders up, grab your hands, touch to the side. We're gonna do Russian twist. Nice little twist and maneuvers. This is gonna be very beneficial for any park riders, any carvers, any snowboarders who snowboard. It's not to be super beneficial for just engaging the core and having the ability to rotate through your spine. Take your rest as you need. And if you're looking for a big challenge, get your legs long, lay back even further. Do what you can for the next 30 seconds. Fifteen seconds. Five, three, two, one. Now let's get into a plank on your forearms, on your toes. Get down, keep your gauge, your core engaged. We're gonna go for a full one minute. On this one, don't let your tailbone rise in the sky. Just try to keep your ribs down and towards your belly button. Engage the core. Close your eyes if you need to. Keep that core engaged, feeling strong. 30 seconds in, my dudes. Fifteen seconds left. And three, two, one. Now that you guys know all the movements, we're gonna keep going, add some awesome music. Now we're gonna do the same five movements for two more rounds. Let's get let's get it going. Three, two, one, jumping 180s. Three, two, one. Next movement, lateral lunges.
three, two, one. Back to the twist. Three, two, one, rotate in two, and now in the plank. In three, two, one. Now we're gonna go start from the top, back and back to squats. Three, two, one. Now, jumping one in. Three, two, one, lateral lunge. Three, two, one, 
Back down to the twist. Three, two, one, down to the plank. Twenty seconds left. Three, two, one. Comment down below and let me know if you like that style of video because my goal is to make you as awesome as possible in snowboarding. So definitely subscribe. Put post notifications turned on. You're amazing. Also, big shout out to CrossFit Breck for letting me use this space. And if you like this style of content, definitely comment down below and let me know. Also, my goal is to make you as awesome as possible. So make sure you subscribe to the channel, put the post notifications on. Definitely like the video. You're amazing. See you tomorrow. We out. I'm out of breath. 10,000 feet is a little rough. the shirt with the cut on the back is it yeah yeah Camp that. ready to go ready to go in today's video i'm going to give you in today's video we are going to give you five awesome exercises to make you way more of an explosive snowboarder one thing to i always do wrong is don't stare here stare here ah, okay i always do that because then the audience is like what are you looking i'm like i'm cross-eyed don't worry about it <laughs> All right, I got ready? visual problems. <laughs>